the 2018 Tata e-Vision concept. Tata Motors isn't very well known outside of its own market, but if it manages to turn out production models from its most recent concepts, it could find itself in the limelight. The 45X Coupe and H5X concepts weren't bad, but it's almost like we're watching the brand grow a little bit at a time, and you'll think the same thing once you take a good look at the Tata E-Vision, an electric concept that has the looks to put some serious hurt on some of the big boys, if Tata can ever actually bring it to the market. 2018 Tata E-Vision Concept Exterior Design the exterior of the Tata E-Vision concept blends functionality with sleek and desirable looks. The exterior of the Tata E-Vision concept blends functionality with sleek and desirable looks. To be honest, it almost looks like the brand borrowed a Volvo engineer for a while, but we'll leave that argument for another time. Highlights of the exterior include the long LED strip that runs from headlight to headlight and the LED units hidden away below the front tip of the fenders. The hood has just the right amount of character while the lower fascia makes good use of the space afforded by the lack of a radiator grill. To put it simply, this is a prime example of how EVs can look good without having fake grills and vents up front. The side profile is dominated by three major body lines and a small concave section at the bottom of the doors. The belt line is thin and sleek, as are the mirrors and the door handles that are tucked away in the doors. Take special note that the chrome trim from the bottom of the front fascia carries over to the side and those wheels, don't they look similar to Pontiac wheels from the late 80s and early 90s? The good looks continue around back where the fastback-like appearance becomes painfully evident thanks to a long rear windscreen and a short rear deck lid. The good looks continue around back where the fastback-like appearance becomes painfully evident thanks to a long rear windscreen and a short rear deck lid. The taillights are integrated into the corners nicely, and the elevation of that silverfish chrome trim of the rear fascia gives the car a raked look from most angles. All told, it's actually a pretty attractive car and, should it come to market, it could pose a serious threat to the German big boys, based on looks alone, anyway. 2018 Tata E-Vision Concept Interior Design at first glance, the interior of the E-Vision screams Volvo design as well, but there's actually a bit more to it than that. At first glance, the interior of the E-Vision screams Volvo design as well, but there's actually a bit more to it than that. First off, there's generous helpings or real wood. A massive piece runs the entire width of the dash while the steering wheel and door trims get semi-glossed wood trim as well. Thin HVAV vents hide in plain sight on the dash, as does the main infotainment screen that actually slides out from the lower portion of the dash. Don't see it? It's that little strip of wood, right in the middle. The steering wheel has a flat bottom and touch-sensitive buttons because this is the future we're talking about here. That's also why there's an all-digital instrument cluster sitting ahead of the wheel. Leather upholstery is generously thrown throughout the cabin. It's an interesting color scheme, to say the least, but you get an off-white leather below the belt line and a yellow-tinted leather above, with greenish-blue stitching for a pinch of contrast. We haven't had a good look at the rear of the cabin quite yet, but I would suspect there's nothing out of the ordinary, just a bench seat, some decent legroom and maybe a rear climate control system. 2018 Tata E-Vision Concept Performance Tata claims the E-Vision can hit 62 miles per hour in 7.0 seconds on the way to a top speed of 124 miles per hour. The Tata E-Vision concept is built on Tata's new Omega platform, one that's modular and suitable for everything from compact cars all the way up to large SUVs, including electric cars. In this case, the E-Vision is all electric with its battery stashed away in the floorboard. Specs have never been released, but Tata claims the E-Vision can hit 62 miles per hour in 7.0 seconds on the way to a top speed of 124 miles per hour. That's a little mundane compared to what we know about electric cars and how much power they can, ultimately, deliver, but we're talking about a car that's primarily aimed toward the Indian market for now. With that in mind, there's a good chance that this concept will see the production line sooner than later. Tata plans to bring one concept to market already. We're not sure which it is, but it will likely be the H5X because, well, you know, SUVs are hyped beyond belief at the moment. 
Beyond that, the E-Vision could be the next concept to make its way to production, however, it will probably be offered with a range of conventional engines first, with hybrid and full EV versions coming later on once the model has been established. Final Thoughts For an automaker that is largely unknown outside of its home market, Tata does turn out some pretty interesting and realistic concepts that are pretty well suited to go into production with nothing more than a few minor changes. Whether or not the E-Vision concept will head into production remains to be seen but, if it does, it could serve as a strong competitor for Mercedes, Audi, BMW, and even Volvo and Acura, if Tata plays its cards right. Of course, it'll have to venture out into the world to ever have a chance at that, but with those looks and that kind of luxury, it would certainly stand a good chance. Love it its attractive luxurious interior potential for production, Leave it performance as whack no word on range references. Read more details about the 2018 Tata 45X concept. Read more details about the 2018 Tata H5X concept. Read more Geneva Motor Show news. Read more Tata news. If you liked this video, please share your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to hit the subscribe button.